Hello there everybody, my name is Mohamed Alvizuni, I'm a second year medical student at Aston Medical School and today I'll be giving you guys my advice on how you could deal with nerves and anxiety during interviews or once you're preparing for an interview. Um, so I've already chosen this topic because I know uh, interviews are very close and you might be feeling very anxious and very nervous but as long as you bear these in mind, you'll do very well in, in the interviews and you'll remain calm throughout the interview. So the number one or the golden standard uh, in reducing anxiety is action so by pr practicing practicing and practicing you become comfortable and you become less nervous so you could easily do this by preparing um, and practicing questions and scenarios uh, in advance so you become more comfortable in the uncomfortable itself and you become more equipped and very well prepared to answer any question or any uh, any scenario thrown at you so that's number one number two is to keep uh, the idea that they're not there to catch you out, they're not trying to make you look bad, they're there to get the best out of you. They've only chosen you for an interview because they see potential, they see that you have the right skills, the right attitude uh, to become a very good student and hopefully a very good successful doctor. So they've chosen you for a reason. So just go there, be confident, be yourself and show them what you have uh, to give and that you know, you're the, the right person to, to, be, you know, to be a student, to be a medical student at their medical school. So that's number two. I want you to also bear in mind that, that, you know, do not think ahead. Do not think about the results. Don't think about the outcomes. That could um, have a, you know, a very bad effect on your mentality. You start to fear the worst. You think about, oh, you know, I've made a mistake. But instead, think about what's the next step, how you could tackle the next question. Um, what's the next station going to be? That's what you want to be thinking. You don't want to be thinking about what the outcome will be, what, what the result will be. Think about now, think about the right steps to tackle the next question or the next scenario and that way you'll remain calm and focused uh, on the on the, the, the correct thing. Um, another thing that you should um, also think about is that once you're, you know, you're panicked or you don't know an answer to something, it's okay to take your time, to take a minute, take 30 seconds, take 40 seconds just to think and relax and take a deep breath and answer the question with your best ability um, the examiner wouldn't mind or the interviewer wouldn't mind so it, it just shows them that you know you're trying that your best to answer the question and um, so if you if you panic or you don't have an answer just, it's okay take a minute out just think about it take a deep breath and then that way you'll be in the right state to answer the questions and one final thing i would give you is to enjoy the interview you know, they're not there, once again, they're not there to catch you out. They're trying to get the best out of you. So showcase what you have, showcase your skills, show your, you know, show your confidence, show your passion to them, enjoy the interview and you'll do very well. Um, so yeah, these are my tips for you. Hopefully um, you do very well, you remain calm um, and you know, you'll be very confident in the, in the interviews and you do very well and, and I'll be happy to hear your stories. So yeah, see you guys um, later.